Almost 400 years after Christ's ministry among the Nephites, Moroni recorded on his plates the Nephite sacrament prayers in their entirety and testified that they were used in administering the sacrament according to the commandments of Christ. These words are clearly related to the words that the Savior used in administering the sacrament in 3 Nephi. But 3 Nephi does not say exactly what the words of the prayers were. So how was Moroni confident that what he wrote was accurate? For one thing, the traditional words of the sacrament prayers must have been written down on the large plates at or near the time of Jesus. Also, a connection between what Moroni wrote and what King Benjamin said as he put his people under covenant during his speech may also have played a role in how the Nephites were able to remember the sacramental prayers word for word after Christ's ascension. The words of Jesus likely replaced the language of a rich history of covenant-making rituals among the Nephites, especially those of King Benjamin. It's possible that Jesus used familiar Nephite covenantal language to help them better remember. Also, the sacramental prayers would have been immediately implemented and thus quickly memorized, which would add a strong traditional transmission of these precious words. As he finished the work of his father, Moroni began filling in the blanks that would have left future readers at a loss. And at that point, he saw it necessary to include the sacrament prayers word for word. And now you know why.